After spending seven months at the Kondengi Central Prison in Yaoundé, Congo Felix Agbo, Fontem Niber, Paul Aya Abine and some other persons arrested in relation to the violence committed in recent months in the northern southwest regions are on this day, the 30th of August 2017, released through a presidential decree. Visiting their various residents in Boya, at Barista Congo Felix home at Federal Craters, Ebai Michael, his nephew says, he's extremely happy. So after the decree of yesterday, the family members were so happy that at last something like that could come up. We've been praying for that and hoping one day that he could be released and join his family members. It's been so difficult in his absence. As a head of his of the house, a head of the family, we missed him. At Dr. Fontaine's house at Santa Barbara, we met his daughter, our love Lynn. Receiving the news, I was overwhelmed. I, I, I shouted here until as if, and I don't know. I'm even short of what expression, just to express the joy for having receiving the news. Uh, in his absence, really, it was really a bore. So the, the way we live in the house as a father, the way he lives with us, we are always joking, playing, so we really miss those things. Then the home of Justice Aya Paul, his niece, Aya Claudine, gave her reactions. When I heard the news, I was so happy because he has been in hell. Yeah, he has been to hell and back. We didn't even know he, that he'll come out alive. Because the entire family has been down. He is alive. He is like a god to us. From the youngest to the oldest person in our family. At the various homes, preparations have been carried out in order to welcome them. So we are preparing, we are now, see, as you see, as you can see when you are coming or doing laundry, I have to clean the house, I have to clean his room, have, we have to do so many things for him. And we have to welcome him as a hero himself. The family members did not fail to send out their message to the president. Well, for the president, the authorities, I would say I thank them for the decision that they have taken to, in, to bring peace and calmness in the country. I have no message for the authorities because they have only done what they were supposed to do. Yes. Says Aya was arrested illegally. Aya is not a criminal. According to the press release from the Presidency of the Republic, the decision to release these people is in line with the numerous measures already taken by the government to address the concern voiced by the people of the North and Southwest regions.